This is India, a country of profound beauty and deep-rooted traditions, colorful culture, presents a striking paradox to the first-time visitor. This is also India, but an unhygiene one. There is a different reality beside the color of its bustling streets, and the Holy River, a challenging perception about public cleanliness. As visitors step into this world, the scenes can be jarring. Garbage strewn across streets, open public urination, and food prepared with bare hands in less than ideal conditions become parts of the landscape. Every food stand or restaurant reveals the unconventional use of bare hands in food preparation. The sight of rusty cutlery and tools, and the lack of concern for cleanliness or hand washing after various activities, become surprisingly mundane. And for those looking to quench their thirst, be prepared. The vendor might very well plunge his whole arm into the juice to stir it, adding an unexpected ingredient. Initially, one might think this is due to poverty, attributing the lack of proper garbage disposal etiquette to economic challenges. It's tempting to adjust expectations, considering the widespread poverty. However, this stark difference from the anticipated exotic holiday destination goes beyond mere expectations. This issue isn't confined to the economically disadvantaged alone. Many affluent individuals contribute to the problem accustomed to littering and indifferent to its impact. Wealthy individuals may nonchalantly discard their trash on the streets, relying on maids and sweepers to clean up after them. This perpetuates a cycle of disregard for basic cleanliness norms. In response, people have become accustomed to how these stalls operate, and such practices scarcely raise an eyebrow anymore. There's a hopeful sentiment that these conditions might shift within a generation or two. However, immediate change seems unlikely, as current leadership appears more focused on strategies that disturb social peace for electoral gains, rather than fostering immediate improvements in public hygiene and cleanliness.